Hello and welcome to a shoulder opening 10 minute stretch. This is what I do whenever my shoulders are tight. I feel like I'm sitting hunched over. In fact, I feel like that now. So I was gonna do this stretch anyways and I figured why not just um, do this and post it for other people to use too. So um, and my name is Rachel of Rainbow Rach. Welcome to this space. Go ahead and grab a dog leash. <laughs> Um, if you don't have a dog, you could use a yoga strap too. Um, you can use a t-shirt, you can use a hand towel, just something that has that like pull. And then um, I usually start with my tighter shoulder. If you don't know what shoulder it is, just start with the left. And we're going to take the left arm up, and drape it back, bend at the elbow, and then your right arm will go behind you. And I'll show you what the back looks like. So you can see that. So my hands aren't touching, um, but it's a nice, I'm getting a stretch all through right here. So that's where you wanna feel the stretch. You might feel it right here. If you feel it in the shoulder that you're not meaning to stretch, just go really easy and gentle and really try to just maneuver your body so that you can feel it on the left side. And I'll show you what I mean by that when I switch to the other side. But take a deep breath in. Inhale, really expand the lungs. Exhale. It's almost like your shoulder blades get a little bit closer together. Finding that opening in the bottom of your arm. If you find that your back is arching, try to just bring a straight, a straight spine to the curve that might be going on in the lower back. Last inhale, really stretch through that left side. And exhale, and take your arms straight out in front of you, cross the left arm over the right, and then bring them, um, and you'll bring the palms to almost touch each other. If you can, you wanna wrap that, let me turn so you can see, but you'll wrap the right hand around the left so that you're kind of hugging into that thumb. And it might look like, it might just look like this. Maybe this is enough. So wherever your body wants to take you. And then you should be feeling this the most in your left shoulder, but you will probably feel it in both shoulders. So just take a few breaths here. Try to send your breath to your back, to your shoulders rather. your legs crossed, go ahead and switch the crossing. You can even with your inhale move up. And then exhale, move down. It's whatever you want. If you're not ready for movement, don't worry about it. Just stay as you are. I like to kind of round my shoulders on the down, really get that nice stretch in the side of my left shoulder. <sighs> Inhale, come up if you're moving. Exhale, down and release. 
right side. So take your dog leash. Actually, let's grab a drink of water real quick. Uh, anytime that you're stretching, it's good to drink some water because it helps just the elasticity with your muscles. So this time, grab the leash in your right hand. And then bring the right hand straight up. Bring your left arm back behind you. And then you're going to walk. Um, just kind of walk the hands together. And now my left shoulder here is talking to me. So I'm going to... I'll show you this side too. But... So quite a big difference here than my other side. So I'm going to just keep this shoulder pretty low because I'm getting a lot of sensation right here. So I'm just going to keep this hand low and then keeping this here, just kind of finding a placement that feels good where I can still feel that stretch in my right side, but it isn't too much on my left. And so I always try to start with the less open shoulder first. Um, because it just it, opening up that that tougher side can help <sighs> and focusing on um, opening through the right shoulder <sighs> really sending your breath there straight spine Reaching up. And you don't have to be at like a full throttle. This could be super gentle. You're really just looking for that opening in that right shoulder and sometimes maybe even the left, the, the one that you're not even trying to stretch. Because I definitely feel it pretty equally in both sides right now. Making space with each breath. Just take a moment of gratitude here that you showed up for yourself, that you're here trying to get your body to feel better. Two more breaths. one. Big inhale. Awesome. Let go of the strap and release. Ooh, itchy eyelid here. Okay. Now, again, bring the hands in front of you. Cross the right elbow over the left. Hands go straight up and the back of the hands almost touch each other. If this is enough for you, awesome. Stay here. If you need a little bit extra, just reach with your left hand back to your to the um, thumb of your right hand, to the kind of like the palm of your thumb. That makes sense. And you can wiggle around and stretch here. Again, switch the crossing of your legs again. And really just get steady before you make any movement. And then stay here if this is enough. If you want a little bit extra, go ahead and inhale and the elbows move up. go down you can even just hang out at the bottom here really take a chance to round through the upper back
inhale, come back up. One last stretch at the top. If you're moving, and as high as is comfortable, and make sure to de-shrug your shoulders. Then exhale, move down. And exhale, back to center, and release. All right. And then if you have a second, you can go ahead and put your hands in reverse prayer. And again, I'm gonna show you what mine looks like because it doesn't have to be pretty. It doesn't have to be perfect by any means. So I kind of just touch my middle fingers and I wiggle them until I'm in a reverse prayer. Staying here. I try to do this for five minutes if I have the time, but if you only have the 10 minutes, then um, we're at 11 minutes already, so you did good. Again, stay in that position as long as you want. Um, I hope this was helpful. I hope that this helps you open your heart and just feel better in your body um, after a long day of just working and even just momming or dadding or whatever, parenting, whatever. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for being here.